हेलो चिल्ड्रन हाउ आर यू ऑल आई होप यू ऑल आर गुड एंड डूइंग वेल एट होम सो चिल्ड्रन एज यू ऑल नो फ्रॉम टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट विद आर ऑनलाइन पोस्ट मिड टर्म एग्जामिनेशन सो चिल्ड्रन टूडे इज योर इंग्लिश एग्जाम आई होप यू ऑल हैव गिवन और यू ऑल विल गिव द एग्जाम वेरी नाइसली एंड एज यू ऑल नो दैट दिस इज आर ई वी एस online class and we are going to do revision till evs uh, exam okay and as as you all know that your evs exam is on 18th of december so till then we are going to do evs revision in the pattern in the same pattern as it will be coming in your exams okay in the mcq pattern so children as you all know that when uh, when i give you the revision work you have to complete it in your revision notebooks is that clear so children please take out your revision notebooks and write down today's date that is 14 12 2020 and give the heading evs revision number 7 because revision 6 we have completed last week so now we are going to do evs revision number 7 of chapter number 10 11 and 12 now this revision will be combined revision okay uh, now coming to our today's exercise children in this i will explain it to you with answers okay but make sure that when i will give you the assignment i will only give uh, the question as well as the two options but i will not give you the answer okay you have to write it on your own you have to put the tick in your notebooks in your revision notebooks on your own after reading uh, the sentence and reading the two options you have to make out that uh, which is the uh, suitable option which is the correct answer and then you have to put a tick okay in the same manner you have to do your uh, examination also is that clear children now starting with our today's exercise in this i have taken uh, fill in the blanks as well as true false i will be taking okay so uh, two exercises only of all these three chapters fill in the blanks and true false will be included in this okay and uh, this will complete with our uh, today's revision 7 and in revision 8 i will do uh, give other three uh, other exercises okay so make sure that you complete all the exercises all the revision work as well as you please listen to every video each and every video very carefully okay so shall we start now okay now the first question farm and pet animals are called dash animals okay this is your question now the two options are like first one is wild second is domestic okay so farm and pet animals are called dash animals they are called domestic animals okay so we will put a tick in front of domestic animals because what uh, what are wild animals children wild animals are those uh which live in jungles in forest okay we don't uh, keep these wild animals at our home we don't, uh, don't we don't keep them in our farms okay so they are wild animals but here we are asking you that farm and pet animals jo hote hain unko hum kaun se animals bolte hain they are known as domestic animals clear now coming to the second sentence dash is used to make shoes bags belts and purses you all know kis cheez se shoes bags belts or purses bante hain are these made up or uh, made from wax or leather correct answer is leather so we will put a tick in front of leather is that clear now coming to the third sentence trains are the dash means of land transport are they fastest means or are they slowest means so trains kaise means of transport hai fastest okay so we will put a tick in front of fastest clear to you all children now coming to the fourth sentence there are dash types of transport kitne types of transport hai three or seven there are three types of transport so the correct answer is three so we will put a tick in front of three clear to you all now coming to the fifth sentence we should not play with dash balls ya sharp things as you all know we all love to play with balls okay so we can play with balls but we uh, should not play with sharp things so the correct answer is sharp things so we will put a tick in front of this i hope these five questions are clear to you all and uh, i'm going to repeat it once again so listen to it carefully farm and pet animals are called dash animals they are known as domestic animals dash is used to make shoes bags belts and purses 
wax or leather so the correct answer is leather coming to the third sentence trains are the dash means of land transport fastest or slowest correct answer is fastest now coming to the fourth sentence there are dash types of transport three or seven so there are three types of transport now the fifth question is we should not play with dash balls or sharp things correct answer is sharp things is that clear to you all children i hope all these five sentences are very clear to you all now coming to the next questions now children coming to the sixth question that is we should always cross the road at the zebra crossing hame hamesha zebra crossing se road ko cross karna chahiye is it true or false there are two options given to you true and false so which is the correct answer true because we, uh, it is always said that we should cross the road at the zebra crossing okay so the answer is true so we will put a tick in front of true now coming to the seventh sentence elephants are used for transport in deserts kya hum desert mein elephants ko transport ke liye use karte hain no so the correct answer is false we will put a tick in front of false deserts uh, desert mein hum camels ko use karte hain so that is why camels are known as the ship of the desert is that clear now coming to the eighth sentence ships and streamers are known as water transport ships or streamers water transport ke liye kehlaye jate hain so uh, is it true or false yes this is true because ships and streamers are water transport we will put a tick in front of true coming to the ninth sentence we should not save fuel hame fuel ko nahi bachana chahiye like petrol and diesel hame nahi bachana chahiye so this is absolutely false hame सेव करके रखना चाहिए हमें फ्यूल को सेव करना चाहिए जबरदस्ती नहीं उसको बहाना चाहिए इज इट क्लियर हमें जबरदस्ती उसको अननेसेसरली यूज नहीं करना चाहिए सो वी विल पुट अ टेक इन फ्रंट ऑफ फॉल्स क्लियर नाउ कमिंग टू द टेंथ सेंटेंस लास्ट वी शुड बोर्ड द बस इन अ क्यू इज इट ट्रू और फॉल्स हमें बस में चढ़ने से पहले एक प्रॉपर लाइन में चढ़ना चाहिए सो दिस इज ट्रू एज यू ऑल नो हमें बस में चढ़ने से पहले धक्का मुक्की नहीं करना है किसी को पुश नहीं करना है वी शुड ऑलवेज स्टैंड इन अ क्यू एंड देन वी हैव टू बोर्ड द बस सो दिस इज ट्रू वी विल पुट अ टेक इन फ्रंट ऑफ ट्रू वंस अगेन चिल्ड्रन आई एम रिपीटिंग सिक्स टू टेन सेंटेंसेस सो प्लीज मेक श्योर दैट यू लिसन टू इट प्रॉपरली सिक्स सेंटेंस वी शुड ऑलवेज क्रॉस द रोड एट द जेब्रा क्रॉसिंग दिस इज ट्रू और फॉल्स this is true then coming to the seventh sentence elephants are used for transport in deserts this is true or false this is false because in deserts we cannot use elephants we use camels okay ships and streamers are known as water transport this is true or false yes this is true because ships and streamers are uh means of water transport coming to the ninth sentence we should not save fuel hame fuel nahi bachana chahiye this is absolutely false so we will put a tick in front of false and in the last we should board the bus in a queue so this is true hame hamesha bus mein chadne se pehle ek proper line mein khade rehna chahiye so i hope children all this uh, all the uh, 10 sentences all the 10 questions with Uh, options are clear to you all and the answers are also clear to you all children i hope this revision 7 is very easy and you can do it on your own and you have got the pattern also that how you will do in your exams so make sure children uh, i want each each and every one of you to uh, score good full marks okay because this exam will be very easy for you all to complete as you have uh, done all the chapters all the subjects uh, ve uh, very clearly before also so there should be no problem in your exams okay so make sure children that you learn all these revision just go through all the revision videos which i have given uh, from the starting and make sure that you complete all the revision work in your revision notebooks children so that it will be very easy to give your exams clear to you all children and in my next video tomorrow we will be doing other exercises also in the same pattern so make sure that these these 10 sentences should be done in your revision notebook clear to you all till my next video children bye bye take care stay at home stay safe and all the best for your exams